The tumor itself is this green structure right here. Dr. Mazi Artalani is pointing to an image of a spine, the same spine he was able to operate on by using augmented reality in May. But this isn't your standard X-ray. Well, I'm trying to figure out how to... to I'm just kind of amazed right now. By combining different medical imaging, doctors can create a 3D model. Emma Royster, the XR program lead at Surgical Theater, helps create those images. This basically has all of their imaging fused together as one. Right here, we're highlighting the CT scan. Um, you can see the bones, so that's what you're going to get from the CT scan. And then we've used the MRIs to segment out further details. Doctors can rotate, zoom, and even add and remove sections like bones, muscles, and organs to create a better view. Dr. Kalani says this helps them plan before a surgery or even during one. You can take that 3D model, go into the OR, and using some of the microscope technology, exoscope technology, endoscope technology, overlay these three-dimensional models onto the actual person you're, you're operating on. He adds this helps give surgeons more confidence and helps eliminate some of the guesswork. You see in relation to that imaging, how big it is on your screen. So you take out just what's on your screen, nothing more, hopefully nothing less. While this tech has been used for brain surgeries for several years, Dr. Kalani recognizes how useful it can be for other procedures. And that means more safer and less invasive surgeries. We can really focus on doing minimally invasive surgery because we don't have to see everything in the open to be able to do the job well. Colton Krulak, KTAR News.